Hello Leo and welcome to your Archangel messages. The Archangels have some special messages that they want to bring to you before the end of the year. So let's get right into your reading and see what they have to say to you guys. bonus what do we have okay the elementals nature spirits the four elements leo this is a sign that there are things that are finally going to come into balance for you all feels right in your world this is a really beautiful energy you are in tune you are in the vibes really trust yourself your intuition pay attention to signs and synchronicities there's an element of magic with this card where you're feeling like the universe is magical in the way um, that your signs are coming in your synchronicities the way things are unfolding it's very magical Leo, I like to see this card for you guys. What do we have next? Emotional desert and activity isolation. Okay, so this is exactly what is needed. Um, some of you have been in a bit of a slump, just not feeling very connected, feeling alone, feeling sad, feeling down, you know, the desert. And the desert represents something different for each of you, but you're coming out of this, Leo. There's some magic that's coming back in. And look at this freedom, letting go, moving on. Yes, very powerful synchronicity right here. That where you're feeling lonely, you're feeling empty, you're feeling purposeless, um, you're just feeling bored. There is a beautiful shift. Something magical is happening and it makes you feel free. 11, that would be a 2. Uh, 12, that would be a 3, and then look at 4. So 1, 2, 3, 4. I'm sorry, 2, 3, 4. Things building and growing for Leo. A big shift. And lastly, what do we have? Relaxation, and peaceful pursuits, and happy times. Okay, Leo, so this tells me that the magic that's coming in for you guys is going to give you peace of mind. It's going to um, just look at the difference in energy here. Hot, long, empty, desolate, and then here, peaceful, um, relaxation, happiness, joy. And look, it's like here's where you are and the uh, oasis there. And then look at there's the water. Here's you. You've found your way to the oasis, Leo. This is beautiful and it's going to feel very freeing for you. Something that's been bothering you. Something that just is, uh, you're fi oh, it's finally leaving. And as that happens, the way it happens, it feels very magical. Also, Leo, some of you might just be really burnt out and you need to take some time off. You need some time in your own energy, okay? Um, some of you, you just feel so disconnected kind of like you're going through the day of things because you need a vacation you need time off you need relaxation and you know that could be just taking some time off to be around the house just in your own energy doing nothing at all enjoying time because when you've just been in motion for so long without a break it can really drain you it can really fry you out and so some of you, the archangels are saying, hey, Leo, take some time off. Take some time for yourself, okay? For other Leos, um, there's just this magic that's coming in. And those of you that take the time off, I feel you experience that magic through the balancing of your energy and you're remembering things. You're coming back to center, There's shifting of energy. Things are going to get good, Leo. Things are getting good. You're moving out of the desert into a beautiful oasis that makes you feel free of some heavy energy that you were dealing with in the past.
And this magic coming in, some of you, have, it allows peace of mind where you're not worried or concerned about something anymore. Some of you have been trying to get out of some sort of contract or something like that. And it's um, maybe like lease something and you're going to prevail. All right, what do we have? Trust in divine purpose. This experience has divine meaning. Healing will come. Know that you are on the path of growth. Okay, so see divine purpose going through the desert. You're gaining, you know, information, insight, growth. And now it's time for a reprieve of relaxation, of blessing, of things coming to fruition from your hard work, from your dedication, from you not giving up. Your prayers are being answered. Your prayers are being received by the divine. Answers will come soon, although perhaps in forms you didn't expect. So keep yourself open to all possibilities of resolution, of healing, because you're you're moving towards something beautiful here, Leo, and it's really going to regenerate you, this experience. Whether it's just the way life circumstances play out through another person, through blessings coming to you, different for all of you as this is a general reading, but you're being filled back full, Leo. And your prayers are being answered, okay? And all of your prayers are different, all right? But they are being answered. Leo, what have you been putting out to the universe? Because clearly you've wanted something to shift and change. And now it's going to come in in a very magical way. Angel of Dreams, Strength, Angel of Courage, the card that represents Leo in the tarot. Okay, you know, right away, um, between now and Pisces season, there is a lot of shift and change. Your landscape is changing. You're moving to a new destination here, energetically. Hermit, Angel of Reflection, Four of Cups, and Diverse. I was going to say... This is like the Four of Cups energy, that blended pr pleasure, where it's like everything's okay, but goodness, it could be better. Seven of Pentacles, vision, feeling kind of like you're spinning your wheels, and Seven of Wands, challenges. All right, look at on the bottom, the sun, angel of happiness, where you are in the dark, the energy of the moon, you know, feeling unsure, feeling uncertain. All of that's going to change, Leo. You are moving into an oasis. And look at this is so interesting. You've got here with uh, the desert. And then we got the sun, which coincides. And then you've got this relaxation, which coincides with the moon. You're going to be healed. Things are going to get better. Things are going to feel cooler, not so hot. And I mean hot is and chaotic. A lot to handle, a lot to juggle. Or just feeling really bored. Here, the moon. You notice that there's an angel sleeping on top of the moon. And then here he is in this hammock. Great rest and relaxation coming to Leo's mind, heart, and soul. Leo, there's magic coming into your life because your prayers are being answered. And again, that oasis there. Through the journey, the sun, you've been enlightened. 
you become more resourceful, you become more knowledgeable, you become more grown in many ways. And now it's time to be blessed and rejuvenated. That is so synchronistic. And see right away, look at that, a synchronicity for Leo. Pay attention to them. Keep knocking all your cards down, Leo. Okay, let's pull some more cards. Let's go deeper. The sun of healing and the moon of replenishing. Maybe uh, those of you that have a water moon, um, if you are a Pisces, Cancer Scorpio Moon, this may be especially powerful message for you. All right, look at this release. Let go of the past, an ending that makes way for new opportunities. Time to move on. Beautiful. The death card, meaning you're coming out of this. Okay, um, and look at 11, 11, 12, 13. So there's that number synchronicity again, and we saw that two, three, four. Wow. So synchronicity is left and right for Leo. Next, we have for winter. Set aside your concerns for now. You can make a decision later. Solutions that come from meditation, the need for more sleep, or a vacation. So this talks about healing, rest, rejuvenation, but also, again, my Leos, if you have time to take off, now is the time to do so. It will recharge your batteries in ways that you cannot even imagine at present. Three of winter, reach out to others for comfort and love. You will go sh grow stronger from the situation, sadness uh, that will heal with time. So part of this emotional desert for some of you has been dealing with the three of swords. Guess what? You're coming to an end of that sadness and you're coming into healing. The dreamer, embrace your true purpose, begin a new adventure, trust yourself. See, being freed, the landscape of your life changing and shifting. And lastly, Ten of Winter, the resolution of difficulties, a weight lifted off your shoulders, the end of an addiction or codependency. So that there is telling you, Leo, the hardest part is behind you now. Your prayers are being answered. Energy is shifting and changing for you. There is a big blessing coming in and you are being healed. Big time being healed. And like three, four, three, four, threes and fours being significant energy building and then things coming to be um, very solid, very stable, a strong foundation. The 10, the completion, um, the zero here, the full, the new beginning. The Archangels want you to know that your prayers are being answered, Leo. And the landscape of your physical life or your mental energy, your emotional energy is about to shift in a very positive way. You're going to understand the journey through the desert, the divine purpose of it, the way it's grown you and shaped you. And see, release. Moving on, letting go, death card with this is very powerful. It is the end to hard times. You also have that with the Ten of Swords right here. It is the end of these hard times, of this struggle for you guys. Something beautiful coming in. Life is what you make of it. Be brave and reach for the stars. Yes, Leo. There is really good stuff happening, okay? This hard stuff over and done with. Your prayers are being answered. The archangels want you to know that. Believe that and feel that, Leo. All right? So those are your messages. I am sending you lots of love and light. Take care.